began our journey in 2015. Uh, my co-founder Govind Sandhu uh, and myself spent two decades in the BPO industry and uh, when we uh, decided that we wanted to build our own dream and not somebody else's dream, Antworks was born. Uh, and when we looked at the marketplace, uh, we knew that automation and AI uh, was the next big wave of technology that was going to take over uh, the world pretty much. We focused our efforts on studying the industry hard, uh, looking at the gaps in the industry, and ensuring that uh, we came at automation and AI from a business process perspective uh, and not a technology perspective. Uh, Anstein, which is the name of the technology platform, is an industry agnostic platform uh, that cuts across uh, banking financial services, right to healthcare, education, media, <coughs> and retail. And uh, over the last four and a half years, uh, we've grown to being across 14 countries uh, we've grown to a little more than 500 people uh, being recognized by the analyst community uh, as a leading uh, AI and technology platform or automation platform for that matter uh, and our clients uh, are happy uh, given that we've delivered to what we call uh, our proof of promise uh, that we make to our customers not only on their business case but also on customer delight. So it's been a great journey so far. We've enjoyed, uh, we've enjoyed the ride. Uh, we've had highs, we've had lows. Uh, when I look back, uh, all I have is a smile on my face. The journey for us uh, in the enterprise uh, software marketplace uh, has been very unique. Uh, given our competition landscape, uh, and given uh, what target markets we're going after, uh, the competition has always sold discrete tools. They've never looked at a business process uh, holistically and looked at that from a, a straight through processing perspective. <clears throat> the competition has brought out tools like OCR, which is optical character recognition, that digitizes data. Uh, the competition has another tool which is RPA, Robotics Process Automation, that automates tasks and not processes, though it's called Robotics Process Automation. Uh, and then you have <clears throat> Machine Learning and Artificial Intelligence, uh, but they're all out there as separate discrete tool sets that an enterprise needs to work with individually and separately um, and build connectors to be able to deliver a solution. As I mentioned earlier, we've come at automation and AI from a very different perspective and from a business process perspective, using a fundamentally different science called fractal science. Uh, fractal is a more deterministic science, while neural is a more probabilistic science. So we looked at uh, you know, business process holistically, and we said, what are the various tool sets required to deliver straight through processing? That's true nirvana for a business owner, when you're able to deliver a business process automated without human intervention 100%. So that's, that's our biggest differentiator and data uh, is another very large differentiator. The world has not looked at data uh, and given it the importance that it deserves. Uh, data ingestion is, is one piece, but data curation and clean data is the starting point of any successful automation journey. And if you ask me, data curation is the Antwerp secret sauce. So the first customer for Antwerp uh, was uh, way back uh, in the early days uh, after we began uh, in 2016. We demonstrated what the technology could do and what the Einstein platform could deliver. Uh, we were blessed by having uh, a technologist on the other side of the table who understood the value of what the technology could do for his business process. He also understood the value of data because he came from a business process background. He also understood the differentiated science approach that we've taken of fractal and neural. Uh, it, was, it was a long process given we were 
uh, a new technology in the marketplace. Uh, this was with a, with a global brand name. He had to make sure that his risk and compliance department was comfortable with us. So it was a, a lengthy journey, uh, albeit an exciting uh, journey for us. And uh, like I said, luck and belief um, paid off. The UAE and the GCC uh, overall is a very exciting marketplace to be in. Uh, in my past life, uh, I dealt with this region uh, and penetrated this region, so I understood the potential and opportunity that lies here. Uh, the governments of the region, uh, especially the UAE, setting up the Ministry of AI uh, is a very unique one in itself. If you look globally, there is no other government that has carved out a separate ministry and funded it to focus on AI. The region uh, has huge opportunity and given its focus on diversification from oil and gas to other industries makes it even more interesting and unique uh, from an Antwerp's perspective. Uh, we thought it was time that uh, we came into the region uh, and we came into the region uh, committing ourselves to the region to make sure that we can embark on this journey with the UAE government. Uh, the PwC report that came out uh, a few months ago uh, clearly says that uh, in the region, UAE will lead the AI charge followed by Saudi Arabia. Uh, and we are here to make sure that that dream for the region comes true. The partnership with SEED um, came about um, a few months ago uh, where both organizations uh, were looking for the right partner uh, in the region. And uh, as they say, you know, if, if it's meant to be, it's meant to be. And in my opinion, uh, it was meant to be. Uh, we were looking for the right partners in the region. Uh, so was SEED looking for the right technology to partner with in the region. Uh, for us, uh, it was a very uh, involved and quick journey right from when we began engaging with, this, with SEED uh, to here, being here today and signing that partnership which is uh, an exciting day for us uh, in the journey and history of Antworks and will go down definitely in the history books. Uh, it's been an absolute uh, seamless, smooth journey working with the SEED team. Uh, I do want to call out uh, Ahmad, who made the journey a lot more easier for us to understand the intricacies and the nuances uh, of the region. Uh, the education was great uh, for us to uh, make sure that we were taking the right decisions and making the right choices from a strategy perspective. Uh, here we are today uh, on the 31st of October 2019, uh, signed the partnership and uh, have a 10-member team uh, in Dubai ready to go after the region. The objectives for the partnership are threefold. Uh, one, uh, to make sure that we don't make the same mistakes that others have made while penetrating the region. Two, to recognize and acknowledge the uniqueness uh, in the region to be able to contribute uh, to the GDP and to be able to support the AI agenda that the Ministry has for the region. Uh, and thirdly, uh, from an Antwerp's perspective is to make sure that we become a household name across the region when it comes to automation or AI. The focus for us across the UAE in phase one of uh, our partnership uh, with SEED is going to be to go after uh, and penetrate the banking financial services uh, industry, the retail industry, oil and gas uh, and uh, retail as well. But what we don't want to lose our eyes on is the diversification that the region is looking to do from oil and gas uh, and manufacturing as well. So those will be some of our focuses uh, to begin with in phase one and uh, we will make sure that we work closely with the seed uh, enterprise uh, to plan for phase two and go after that marketplace in a very structured and disciplined fashion.